What's up everyone? It's me again, Anneli. In today's video, I'm gonna be talking about report of marriage. And if you are Filipino who got married here in United States, you need to submit your report of marriage to the nearest con Philippine consulate. So also, in this video, I'm gonna show you how I did assemble my my documents and how I did or what document documents I sent to the Philippine consulate or Philippine consulate general in Houston. Before anything else, I'm not an expert on this. I can only give you some information based on my experience and some of my friends experience. And if you have any question, just comment down below and I'll try to answer based on my experience and you know some of my friends experience again so don't get mad at me if I cannot answer you can search email or call the Philippine Council legal registration requirement of a married Filipino citizen overseas to report a merit that had occurred in a foreign country with the Consulate General Philippine Embassy. Why is it important? Filing the report of marriage is the way to register the marriage in the Civil Registry of the Philippine Statistic Office, formerly known as NSO. This means a change of your status and record in the Philippines. So the report of marriage will be the one of the evidence in changing legal documents such as the renewing a Philippine passport. I got married 2019 July. I didn't process my papers. I yeah and but I never forgot. I just didn't do it. So this year I filed my my report of marriage to the Philippine Consulate General in Houston. It doesn't affect on your green card interview you can do whenever you feel like but but i recommend you to do it before one year or else you'll do the same as me like i have to um print out the affidavit of delay of report of marriage what are the requirements for report of marriage you have to check if the marriage you want to report is under jurisdiction of the consulate because it may have different we may have different requirements and fee and in our case i submitted it to the philippine consulate general in houston the following states under the consular jurisdiction of the philippine consulate general in houston are the arkansas louisiana mississippi new mexico oklahoma and texas so yeah, civil so registration does not require personal appearance, so and may be sent by a registered mail. Um, so for the cover letter, indicate your request to report the marriage, your contact numbers, email address, and list of enclosed documents if submitting by mail. So whatever you put there, it should be in order. It's my cover letter samples, and I changed my personal information right here. So my name, Anna Lee. Morena is my fa uh, single name. Maganda is my married name. So here, one address and one, two, three, Marigold Circle, Texas, mobile number, email address, and address it to Philippine Consulate General in Houston. Philippine Consulate General in Houston and report of marriage contracted abroad so it said i would like to report my marriage contracted here in united states of america enclosed with are the following documents for further reference processing fee 25 bucks and four original report of marriage one certified true copy and four copies of marriage certificate one original and four copies of birth certificate NSO from Philippine or PCA, four copies of passport of both husband and wife, affidavit of delay registration of marriage, self-address 
a self-addressed return envelope with appropriate stamp, copies and uh, copies of documents submitted or exact photocopies and other documents. Sincerely, your name here. So, for a personal appearance of both parties, if application is to be submitted in person as a report of marriage form must be signed before a consular officer, but we submitted by email. Yeah. So, for original report of marriage forms in the blank ink signed by both husband and wife, the wife should use her maiden name in filing out of report of marriage form. Spouses should also use their age at the time of marriage, not their current age at the same time of filing the report of marriage. If submitting by mail, the so the complete forms must be notarized. I will do a yeah, separate video. I will do a separate video of, of how to fill out the form of report of marriage. So this is basically the the form and yeah it doesn't say the age here one original or certified through copy and four copies of marriage certificate or a contract a showing number of marriage contracted by parties and issued by office of the vital records or any other appropriate office of the states where the marriage took Place. If the number of contracted marriage does not show one certified copy and two regular copies of the marriage license showing the number of marriage must be additional submitted. Only I only use certified through copy and I submit four forty copies of my marriage certificate. One original or certified through copy and four copies of birth certificate of a Filipino from PSA or Philippine Statistics uh, Authority. Then, yeah, before I arrived here in the United States, I brought some extra PS um, birth certificate because I think I might need it in the future. Four forty copies of government issued identification cards or passport of a both husband and wife for Filipino spouses submit copies of Philippine passport um, alien resident uh, resident alien card Philippine dual citizenship identification certificate or or an oath of Aldea. so mine we use passport of my husband and I and for photocopies. Since uh, a former Filipino citizens submit the U.S. certificate of naturalization, even if it of delay registration of marriage, um, you did not arise when reporting the marriage one year or more after its recurrence. So, I will link down below later the website because I also download the the form and actually it's here i think this one and you oh no a filipino spouse was previously married and divorced or previously married and marriage was subsequently annulled if divorced previous marriage is annulled by a foreign Court. The foreign judgment must be recognized by Philippine court. Present one, one original and four copies of annotated marriage. Annotate, annotate. I don't know. Say that. Annotated Philippine marriage certificate issued by PSA or formerly NSO. The Filipino spouse is widow or widower. It's a widower. Um, one original certificate to copy one original or certified through copy or four forty copies of a marriage certificate with the that certificate foreigner if the foreigner spouse is divorced one original or certified through copy and four forty copies of divorce degree of a foreign spouse we for fees 25 bucks 
25 US dollars non-refundable and payable in cash or money order if sent payable to the Philippine consulate. So no personal check or credit cards will be accepted. We did a money order and actually this is the sample. So by mail process documents to be mailed back after three working days upon acceptance provided applicant but it took 20 days for me address self address stamp envelope with pre uh, prepaid postage and tracking number such as the usb priority mail express mail this is enable to track your passport or document when you mailed write legibly your name and mailing address on the both sender and recipient address this envelope is for you to submit this um, to philippine consulate general in houston and this from you So this was my self-address return envelope with appropriate stamp. This thing's here. And you have to stick it off. This is good to go. I sent my documents October 8th and they return after they return the papers after 10 no 20 days. So yep. So they return they received um report of one copy of report marriage. Um affidavit of delay registration of marriage. One photocopy of um, certified true copy of our marriage certificate of marriage. Um, one photocopy of um, birth certificate of my birth certificate. One photocopy of my passport photocopy and also from my husband husband and yep if you have any questions just comment down below because i might forget something and thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel